Hi everyone, welcome to Advice to Think Twice. This is Monica and I'm doing our daily energy and advice reading. So thank you for joining me. I hope you're having a good day. I hope you're having a good week. Let's see what's going on for us, what the energies are that we're dealing with and what we need to know about them so that we can make the most of them. I'm once again all caught up on private readings. Information on private readings is below. Information on the specials that I'm currently running. Um, with a quick turnaround, all that is below as well. So let's see what's going on in the energies of the day. So that is our tarot and the oracle to clarify the tarot for the energies of the day. Well, that's good. That's too many. boys are having a wonder so if anyone jumps on the table which I think Harvey's about to there he is <laughs> that's a candle mama do you like your whiskers do you want to keep them uh, of course you go up top oh and he's gonna jump down in a minute please don't freak out if you are a cat parent you know what I'm on about okay it's a little better all right so let's see what the Oh, he's about to jump down. Right on top of my candle. Mama. Can you not set yourself on fire? Can we not do that right now? Okay. First card that we have uh, representing the influence of the past on our current situation. So we have the Queen of Wands. <sighs> Give me strength. We have the Queen of Wands. Um, and the Queen of Wands talks about a time in our lives when this is confidence this is beauty there he goes he came he wrecked and off he went um confidence beauty attraction okay it's a lot of inspiration it's a lot of creativity it's a time in our lives where we may have been working on ourselves we may have been working on our personal goals we may have been working on our business it's a time of just a lot of inspiration a lot of different ideas and starting a lot of different things in today's energy we have the hermit so we're going from very social energy with the queen of wands a lot of eyes on us type energy to the hermit in, in today's energy and with the hermit this is where okay I've gone out there I've mingled I've mingled I've mingled I've network networked um, I tried different things right this is creativity open mind I've tried different things I've talked to different people I have come up with a lot of different ideas okay and with the hermit in today's energy this is where we buckle down we focus on the one thing and we really go deep getting all the details learning about it as much as we possibly can so this could be a, a time of study reflection actual research speaking to a mentor speaking to a teacher speaking to someone who's doing what we're trying to do um, to get more information, to become um, as much of, a, of an expert as we can in this particular topic or subject that we're choosing to delve into, okay? And then where is it going to lead us? It's going to lead us to the Three of Cups, and this is an energy of celebration. It's going back out into the world, right? Very much socializing energy here, celebrating with friends, family gatherings, um, social events of any kind. Um, whatever it is that we're stepping away from, we're going to be going back into. So it's a temporary energy of withdrawal, going within, spending time on our own, uh, whether that's the whole day or more of the day than usual, to really like dig deep into something, to really look at the details of something, to really learn as much as we possibly can. This is very much buckle down type energy. I'll call you when I'm free. Um, I just need to get this done. I just need to figure this out, right? And in our Oracle energy, what do we have? We have Wolf, wolf Spirit, the God. Turn knowledge into wisdom. Mercury retrograde, I swear to God. Turn knowledge into wisdom. And we do that by applying the knowledge, right? And then internalizing it for ourselves. It becomes our strength. It becomes our wisdom because we not only know the theory, but we also know the practice of it for ourselves, right? And that becomes our wisdom. 
But it's also, again, it's wolf spirit. The wolf and the hermit are very much solitary energy. I need to do this for myself. I need to figure this out on my own. I need to work this out for myself, come up with a plan for myself, right? Does that make sense? And it's like, I, I need to learn as much as I can about this so that then I can figure out my own way of dealing with it, the approach that works for me, right? Talking to a lot of different people, getting a lot of different advice, and then just really sitting with that and, and figuring out what applies to us and what doesn't, right? And then what else do we have? Peacock spirit, let it shine. 46, this could be something to do with an ending or us getting ready to put something to an end. Um, it could be something to do with the heart space. But you see how you have this eye catching attention social every uh, everyone wants to work with us everyone wants to be with us type energy where we're saying okay thank you appreciate that however today's not a good day <laughs> i'm taking a step back so we might be saying no to some people we might be saying no to some invitations but that's okay because this is what we need to do for ourselves at this time the energy is temporary this could be the whole day but it could also be a few hours in the day it could just be you know, maybe usually we have this appointment that we go to or we, we meet up with these people around this day or around a particular time of the day. And then at this time we're saying, you know what, I'm not going to be able to make it today. I'll call you when I'm free. I just really need to buckle down and, and figure this out for myself, okay? So don't be afraid to, 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 to say that to people. Um, give yourself the time to really dig deep into how you feel about things. Let it shine. Let it let it out, right? How you feel about things, what you think about things, what you believe is the best approach um, for you to figure out your way out of a situation. Um, and then just once you have that knowledge, once you have that wisdom, then you can go back into the social world, then you can go back to same old, same old type of routine. But today is important. I feel like a lot more information can come to you today than usual or you're just in a different mind, sp mind space where you just make connections a lot faster or things are more, I don't know, clearer uh, than usual or, they, or than they would be on any other day. Does that make sense? So this is a day to take time and make the most of this energy because that's what we're looking at. And the energy is conducive to research, study, contemplation, figuring things out for yourself. And then you can go back out there and apply what you've learned for yourself. Does that make sense? So I'm going to leave that with you. Let me know what this is for you. Um, but I hope the reading helps. Happy birthday if your birthday is on the 25th of May. I'll do the birthday post on Instagram um, as usual until I figure out a better way to do it. Um, but yeah, let's have a great day. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye for now.